Hey, what's happening everybody? I'm Charles Maring and today I'm doing a real quick tutorial on how to use the AirDrop feature for Apple products to show you how to transfer photographs or videos from your iPad, iPhone to your desktop or vice versa. But first, let's roll that intro. <laughs> So I sent a link this week out to one of my clients because I had created some videos for them and I said, you know, you can download from the link. If you want to put it on your iPad or your iPhone to go, you can go ahead and do that. And they said, well, how do I do that? And I thought, you know, as a photographer and filmmaker, I think we take for granted all the little things that we know. And so I thought there's got to be others that haven't figured this out out there. So I'm going to share here for my client and for everyone else how to use the airdrop feature, which is so easy to do. Now, I have a photograph on my uh, laptop here and I want to get it to my iPhone. What do I do? Well, let me show you how. I'm going into the laptop here and it could be a photograph, a series of photographs or a video. I'm going to just select this photo on the desktop and if I go up into the hard drive here and I click on airdrop, I'm going to see two things pop up right now because my, my phone is physically on, I'm logged in, my iPad is on, I'm logged in, so I have a choice. As long as we're on and logged in, it'll pop up and I can just say transfer to my iPhone by dragging and dropping it on iPhone and at the same time I'm going to bring us over. You'll see my phone says, oh, we're sharing and then it will actually pop up and pop right in. There I am in my studio with all my photography lighting gear, that's the photo I wanted to share. So with that said, yesterday I was in Newington and I saw this no skateboarding sign and I thought I'm taking a picture of it to send to my buddy because uh, this always frustrates us, you know, having grown up being a skater. Now I'm going to send this to my laptop here with ease by going to the lower left corner in my photos app, clicking on this little icon and anything that I have check marked. I can send, as you can see, via AirDrop to my iPad or MacBook Pro. We'll send it to the MacBook Pro. Click. It's going. We'll go back over to the computer. It will come right in and it will put it automatically into the downloads folder on my Mac. There it is. Quick and easy. So that's all. That, I was just wanted to share that so that everybody understands exactly how to use AirDrop for transferring videos or photos any direction you want to send them, all Apple products, it works. Appreciate you everybody. Have a great one.